have you ever heard from George Washington or Abraham Lincoln, like really, you know, big, big names in our, in our world? The only time I'd say that I would have um, is if the individual that's receiving the session has connection with them, either as family or very close friend. I do remember years ago, and I mean years ago, a young lady who had come to me that um, President Buchanan had showed up. Wow. And he had been a distant relative of hers. Wow. But I think also the person would have to know that that's true. Right. Um, you know, like if uh, when I did that um, genealogy thing, 23 and me, I know it, yeah. sounds, like a, it sounds like a bad porno movie. Um, <laughs> but um, I did that and it came up, you know, both branches of my family, my mother's and my father's, both branches started in East Africa and then moved up, you know, went to Russia and Poland and, you know, made their way up through Spain and out on my mother's side and ended up in England or Ireland or whatever. Right. Hence, you know, you can't get any whiter than me. And um, they, um, and then I thought of like, you know, the days of the slave trade. I mean, you could have been selling members of your own family into slavery right. and not realizing it. Um, I also had uh, heard that in India, it was the Brahmins who started that, I guess, essence of like white superiority, that the whiter you are, the more important you are. And I said, well, I, I know I pass, but... Um, <laughs> In any case, uh, they had um, somebody had come to my house one day and were curious as to this bust I had and said, you know, oh, when did you pose for that? I said, what are you talking about? I didn't pose for that. I bought it, you know, from some Russian guy at a flea market in the city because it was a, um, a bust of the last czar of Russia. And he says, and that's when I had, you know, the dark beard and more hair. And, and he said, wow, because you and he look alike. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and even now I do have a portrait of the czar hanging in the house. And I'll say to people, does he look like me? Do I look like him? And everybody says, yes. I'm like, I don't see it. But, family had gone up through Russia on my father's side. If there is any um, connection, it would have to be very distant cousin because mm -hmm. I noticed um, my first cousins presently, I really don't see any resemblance among us. But yet, mm -hmm. The European cousins, that would be like first cousins once removed or second or third cousins. I can see definitely, definitely resemblances. Um, my aunt uh, in Ireland in 1920, I believe, I have her profession day photograph when she became a sister of St. Louis the Ninth, And people have made fun of me saying that it's me dressed up like a nun. I am like, Oh my it. God. I said, that's not me dressed up like a nun. That's my <laughs> aunt. And they said, my God, though, the resemblance is incredible. The eyes, the eyebrows, right. the face, everything. Right. And I guess, you know, maybe I have more genetics from that side of the family. I'm presently waiting for another, um, genetics uh company that does it um they go back like over 50 years we and did it too uh, just yeah. as a as a side as a reference of a side our great grandmother's first cousin was hetty lamar so wow. yeah that's i mean so yes we're kind of eric and i are have the same blood as hetty lamar